Hello and welcome back to Age of Empires Definitive Edition and Enemies of Rome. The Emperor Valerian lies captive in a Persian dungeon following his defeat at Edessa. His son and successor Gallienus faces revolts in Egypt and Gaul. The Empire is in turmoil and the Persian Horde continues its westward march nearing your client kingdom of Palmyra. The Emperor is entrusting you, Odinathus, King of Palmyra, to serve Rome by defeating the Persian host. Drive the Persians from Syria and take our war to their cities and you will be acclaimed Imperator Orientus, Commander of the East. Okay, so the objectives here will be destroy the Persians. Supplies are very limited in the dry deserts, so protect your remote camps at all costs. A defensive strategy is necessary until you have built enough troops for a successful offense. In 260 CE, the Persian Shah Shah something something, King of Kings, Shapur I raided Roman territory in Syria and northern Mesopotamia. The Emperor Valerian met the Persian army near Edessa but suffered one of the most significant defeats in Roman history. When the defeated emperor attempted to negotiate with Shapur, he was captured. Beset by revolts everywhere in the empire, Rome turned to a Romanized Arab king named Odonatius, ruler of a small but powerful client kingdom called Palmyra, to avenge the defeat. In the 3rd century CE, Palmyra was a wealthy Syrian city astride a prominent caravan route. Although attached to the Roman province of Syria, Palmyra enjoyed autonomy and had, under Odonatius, been elevated to the status of a kingdom. Though the sources around Odonatius' rise are ambiguous, his military successes against Persia earned him the trust of the Romans and significant power and influence. Odonatius followed Valerian's defeat with stunning offensive victories in Persian territory, even twice besieging the Persian capital at Ctesiphon. In 267 CE, Odonatius was forced to abandon his Mesopotamian campaign due to an influx of Herulai tribesmen raiding in the Black Sea coast of Anatolia. Soon after the Palmyrian king was assassinated under unusual circumstances, the kingship then passed to Odonatius' young son, with the dead king's widow Zenobia serving as regent. Okay, so we're back um, playing on Hardest here after the Revolt of Spartacus failure. Okay, let's see. We definitely need some food. We do have uh, a lot of food here as well. Although I think we probably want to protect these as much as possible. Okay, I'm actually... So we are Palmyran. Villagers are more expensive, but they are slightly better. Camel riders are 25% faster, that's good. Tributes are free, trade ships return more gold. Maybe we should try camel riders a bit here. They are kinda expensive though, but that's fine. Okay, so we need to train some more villagers. And yeah, I think we do upgrade the... Um, Here we go. Definitely have some um, annoying boys here. Okay, can we... Uh... Oh, holy cow, that's a lot of archers. Please attack the towers at least. Oh, they immediately. Okay, well, we need to get rid of that. Oh, the camels are really, really fast here. That's good. 
Oh, no. Hello? Please kill that. There's no way that I want to let that escape, dude. Okay, that's good. It's very, very unfortunate here, but... Um, we need to get some food rolling here. Uh, it's unfortunate I lost both of those villagers. That kind of sucks. Okay, so we need to advance to the next age as well. Yeah, that's... The camel, I think the camel riders here are gonna be... Oh, absolutely not. Yeah, let's get that going, please. Please. Oh no. Oh no. This is really unfortunate. Well, at least we're getting some food back now. The camels are really, really fast. I feel like I probably need them. So let's keep, keep going with them. They also do um, increase damage to cavalry. Which we definitely need, apparently. Holy cow, these are absolutely murdering my units here. Okay, that's unfortunate. That's really, really unfortunate. Well, we are gonna protect the food here, as much as possible. This guy is definitely gonna die. There's no way. Okay. I don't know if this has stabilized or not. I feel like the answer to that is probably a big freaking no. Uh, no, 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 no. Oh, right. The towers are 150 now. Yeah, okay. Good. Very good. Oh no, that's that's not good though. But we have four towers here, which should be fine. Please get that. Okay. <clears throat> Can we maybe start farming a bit more here? Kinda want this faster villagers as well.
Let's, uh... Let's get the range first. Alright, you actually need to get some more stone, though. I'd like you to repair this tower, though, because, uh... It's a bit too much not having that. So... Well, we have some berry bushes here as well. We should probably gather on those. I really like the cavalry when they're so fast. They're really good. Okay, so we have 11, 15 villagers right now. The villagers for this civ is pretty, they're pretty, oh. Yeah, there's, there's no way that this is gonna happen. Like, actually, no way. Go away. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go with, uh, with damage for now. That's fine. Uh, you are welcome to donate more of your villagers here, that's fine. I'd like a scout here as well. Well, we're gathering a lot of food, which is nice. I think we get some vill upgrades here. I'm, I'm gonna keep taking your villagers, that's completely fine for me. That is completely fine for me. Actually, scout. Uh, I want you to um, scout the map for me. Finally enough. Oh, bro. You are actually serious. All right, we um, definitely need more houses here. So they built a cheeky granary there. Or storage pit, sorry. That is definitely not okay. Will not accept that, I think. Okay. We're gonna need a ton more gold that we don't have right now. So I'm just gonna explore the desert here a bit. Make sure that we actually know what's going on and where the resources are and stuff like that. Fine. They want to keep donating troops to me or villagers. That's. I will accept. So we need 800 gold, which we do not even have. We also need two Bronze Age buildings, which we also don't have. So that's 16, 17. 22, roughly. I think we're gonna stop with villagers after this one. So they are also food, very food intensive. 
Okay, so government center. Build that here. We'll take temple. That's fine. Don't really want them to mine my um or to take my wood, honestly. Oh, okay, okay. This double attack here is kinda annoying. But that's fine. Okay. Okay, that's a lot of units. You guys are welcome to try and get this, but I don't think you will. Okay, that's... That is fairly annoying. <laughs> Can you guys actually kill this instead of, like, fucking around with that other thing, please? I think that tower lives somehow. Okay, yeah, we got a lot of food now. Building hit points. Hit points for Cav would be good. Perfect. Okay, and then... Definitely this. And I want to repair that tower, please. So that's 15, 19... Something like that. We lost a lot of villagers there, unfortunately. We need gold. We can get the plow. I do like the camels though. guys need to probably build two towers here first we don't have enough stone to do that but okay. that's unfortunate but okay. I guess the camels have to go there Uh, yes, they definitely have to go here. Oh, that tower is gone. It's unforge. Oh, shit. What the hell? Well... Okay. That's that's interesting. Um get stone please. Uh some gold as well. Five fifteen twenty twenty four. That's gonna be enough, right?
Uh, hopefully, that's going to be enough. I was hoping we could be a little bit aggressive here, but it kind of doesn't look like it that much. Still need this. If we look at the tech tree again... Yeah, this doesn't have a stronger unit. Okay. Kinda sad, but it's it's fine. Okay, so you guys definitely Oh, there's two here as well. Okay. You are free to donate some more cavalry to me. I will accept. Perfect. With this, I can also spend way more on camel riders now. So maybe maybe this amount of food. And then you guys go mine instead. We uh, we don't need that much wood with this unit composition. That's fine. We can, can do that. So those boats are kind of scary. I don't like that. There's a lot of boats here, holy moly. Okay, okay, okay. We need to go back. We need to go back faster, guys. A lot faster. Please. I think we do that. I don't think we lost anything significant. This is just really, really annoying. Uh, okay, so we're getting those upgrades. We're definitely getting guard tower. We are definitely... Oh, we can't get any more damage, but we are going to get the, um, the other upgrade here. Yeah, we are going to wreck this guy because I can. I think we also get this, honestly. That's fine. So we have the guard tower now. You are done with that. You will build another tower there. We're getting that upgrade. That's fine. Don't really care about any of those upgrades, honestly. Well. 
I think with this tech it's time for us to uh, go offensive a bit. I'm wondering if they sacked all their villagers to our towers or not. Kinda looks like it. It kinda looks like it. Eighteen hundred and then some extra stone. Mm. It's a lot of range. Okay. I think we try and get maybe a few more stables in here. Okay, okay, okay. That's unfortunate. So I think this is gonna fall. It is. Definitely need more wood, though. That's definitely the case. We are out of wood, currently. That's that's not good. Okay, it's time, uh, I think, for us to be um, giving some back. Okay, you completed a wonder. Can they win with a wonder or what? I don't know. Would be ideal. is not great right now but we're gonna fix that we'll fix that we will deny them of this but to the cost of at least a dozen or at least a handful of uh, camel riders here I'm not sure if they overcommitted on ships or what happened. Maybe they can can't build any more uh, units. Okay, fighting under these towers here is not going great. Oh, okay. Thanks for annoying me, I guess. See if we can get that. So we're still at around 18 villagers, which isn't 
exactly ideal. We've got a bit too many camels now. Let's see if we can go in here again. Maybe they rebuild some economy here on the left. We can go kill that first. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Oh, hello. Just want to check if they rebuilt anything here. It doesn't look like it. Okay, let's go. And that actually doesn't matter that much. Anything that, that does damage to us is what we want to get. Them spamming some villagers is not that important, honestly. Okay, let's get that. We're no longer mining gold, which is a bit unfortunate. This guy is almost done with that. We have some over here. We can probably start tapping that. Okay, the towers in here are uh, kind of annoying. Oh no, where where is that? I don't even see it. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I don't want that. Let's get rid of that. And we're building two towers here just in case. Let's wreck this. This is not great, but... No, that's... that's really not that great. That's gonna be a lot of sacrifices to get that going. So we're definitely... Getting this rolling up here. That's fine. You'll get the gold. You'll get gold as well. We're definitely running low on gold. Oh, we have some here as well. Okay, okay. That's me being an egg. Let's get that going, please. Okay, now we have free reign over this, finally. Okay, 
That's that's fine. So we have free reign over this and we can get the the wonder and everything. And no towers to annoy us. Which is great. Wish they would do a little bit more damage to this. We could have gone elephants, I guess. Or even... Oh, we don't have, um, we don't have elephant archers, that's a shame. Otherwise, that's always a fun choice. So you mind that, you'll go there. Not really scared of any counterattacks anymore. There goes the wonder. I wonder where it went. I figured they have a base here as well. I'm very curious to see if it's better or worse defended than this. I'm sure if you can win one on one against this. Probably not. Oh, that's unfortunate. We can always switch to chariots if we really want to. is a possibility. No. Absolutely not. Let's get some more. Oh. Can you please kill that? Or not. Well, they don't have much up here anymore. Okay. That's really, really unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. Let's get this as well. The small sad town center that they have. Let's build a storage pit there. Well, the important thing here is going to be dodging the boats. I hope I can actually do that. Kill them in the shallows, maybe. Oh, there's some shallow here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna not worry about that dock at all right now. If they want to build more boats, then feel free. For some reason, they're really struggling with food. If 
For some reason, they're really, really struggling with food. Okay, well, there. There's more priests here somewhere. That we would like to kill. Okay, please kill that. You guys. I'm not sure if they built a boat here. We'll see. But I really wouldn't mind if the Ballista Tower could just take care of that. For us. This dock, I mean. I would like the stone, honestly. Oh. Four damage per shot is not that interesting. Oh, okay, there's a lot of... There's a lot of boats here as well. Okay, that's fine. I wonder if there's any resources in here. Doesn't look like it that much. Let's uh, explore this and see. Oh. Soundforge. Oh, you're actually gonna win against that ship. Okay. Interesting. Apparently the Ballista Towers are very, very strong. I don't care that much about that anymore. I'm wondering if this is in range of this. So I'm, it looks like we have to destroy all their buildings. Which is a bit unfortunate, but... They have lo really, really long range,
Okay, this is fairly annoying as well. Uh, can we please kill these? I don't have anything great to kill these ships with. Can you go in here, please? I wonder if one of them died there. Could be. I think we need to destroy these docks. It's really unfortunate. I don't think there's any other buildings, really. Oh, there is here. There's another catapult ship there. Oh, there's a lot more here. That's unfortunate. Maybe I can lure them to the shallows here. Uh, yeah. I don't know about that. Great. Oh, this was the last mission on this campaign. Okay. Word of your success has reached the Emperor Gallienus. He is most pleased with his Palmyrian allies and confers great titles upon you. Enjoy the spoils of victory, Odinathus, and the company of your young sons and beautiful wife, Zenobia, as the triumphs of ambitious men like yourself are often fleeting. That's going to be it for, uh, for this episode. Thanks for watching and uh, have a really nice day.